Well, Stephen, um, welcome to Bristol Rovers. Um, you've got the, the kit on and um, you've signed up. How pleased are you to be on board? Yeah, really pleased. Yeah, I'm excited. You know, as soon as the, the phone call came in to come and play for the club, I was, I was really excited and glad to get it over the line and all signed and done. What have the last few weeks and months been like for you? Starting off at Fleetwood, um, I think you've had a loan at Shelton this season. Um, you, you ended your contract a week or two ago, so you've had some choices to make. Yeah, it's it's been an unusual maybe you know twelve eighteen month period since I since I went to Fleetwood really it was it was a strange strange scenario that I, you know, I ended up leaving the club and it was one of them things you know I got to as I say I got to play a month uh, at Chatham which I really enjoyed you know get to play football again but um, as I say go, glad to put that behind me and I look forward to uh, first team football. How's the fitness? Because you haven't played as much first team football as you'd like this season. Obviously, yeah, I'd, I'd love to, to be playing every game, but I haven't, unfortunately. You know, I won't take much to get up, up to speed. Um, tell us a bit about your, your qualities then. What, what will you bring to Bristol Rovers? <laughs> Hopefully, you can be the judge of that after a couple of games. But no, I, I, I'm here to score goals. I, I, I'm, that's, that's what I love to do, and hopefully, I can help the side out playing. Yeah, um, you're 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 a skillful player. I mean, are most of your goals in the six-yard box. Are you a poacher, or can you can you can you score a variety of goals? Again, again, it's more for other people to say. You know, I can score a whole set of goals, but I'm saying I'm just I'm just here to, to enjoy my football and to score goals. How do you look back at your career so far? Um, are you pleased with your goal scoring record as a player? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty much one and two for starts throughout my career, which uh, I'd like to keep going. Uh, uh, the I've had I've had spells in my career where I've, I've been quite prolific. I've I've really enjoyed spells at Chatham and, and Colchester, um, so you know, I say the last last twelve months months of Fleetwood were, were, were strange and so it didn't go according to plan. Do you do you have some sort of um connection? Do you think with with the West? You obviously you played for Bristol City and you, and you played for for Cheltenham as well. Is is the West a part of the, a part of the world that you're, you're happy with? Yeah, definitely. I, I love living. I lived in Bristol for three years when I, I played for City and. I say a stadium when I was at Cheltenham, so I yeah, really, really do enjoy the city. You know, me, my wife went to the university, and I say we've got a real affection for the for the place, and I'm, I'm glad to be back. I guess um, it's a long, long, a lot of water under the bridge since you played for Bristol City now, and um, you'll be looking forward to playing for the blue half of Bristol. Yeah, definitely. The bottom of the M32 looked a little bit different since the last time I came down <laughs> it, but uh, no, I'm saying I'm, I'm glad to be back and glad to you know, be wearing the blue. What's it like um, when you walk into a dressing room for the first time? Do you feel a bit nervous? Is it a bit like the first day at school? <laughs> yeah, it is. It is. It's, it's, it's not a bad comparison, to be honest. Um, you know, obviously, I've, I know John Joe from, from my Colchester days, and uh, yeah, it makes it a little bit easier. But as I say, as soon as, as, soon as the ball comes out, it, it's, all, it's all easy. Yeah. Are you pleased to have JJ on board? Not from just a personal level, but from a from a he's a real asset to Bristol Rovers, isn't he? Oh, definitely. I'm sure. You know, I'm sure he's, he's been talking an awful lot about him because the season he's had. But um, you know, I, I remember him at Colchester where it didn't go so well for him, and you could still see the qualities he had. He was, you know, he's a very good player. Well, he's a good, very good player. So, he's a, there's little things like that. You think when when you're going to sign for a club, you've got players like that of that calibre. Then, it makes it quite easy. I gather there might have been more than one club interested in you. Is it um, was John Ward a big factor in you agreeing to join the club? Yeah, definitely, definitely he was. Um, you know, the fact that it was Bristol Rovers as well was a big, you know, a big decision to to come here. It was. I did have a couple of offers, but as I say, you know, the fact of of the gaffer and and the fact of being Bristol Rovers was a massive, a massive help. And you could make yourself um, a hero quite quickly if 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 you hit the ball running because Bristol Rovers are towards the bottom of the league, but the players in the squad you must be confident that they can start climbing the table and be in a better place yeah hopefully this is a false league position it's very tight at the bottom at the moment so a couple of wins and you can be mid table so that's what we're looking forward to doing and you don't necessarily have to play in the middle you can play as long as it's a forward position in the wide positions as well yeah as long as I'm on the pitch I'll, I'll be happy yeah. and playing with Matt Harold as well um, you could benefit I, I gather you know, he's obviously a big striker. Could you be a good partnership, you and Matt Harold, potentially? Hopefully, you know. As I say, I've, I've not kicked the ball with him yet, so I'm sure, I'm sure he's, a, you know, he's a top player, and, and normally, you know, good players can play with with each other pretty easily. Yeah, Oxford are coming up. That's a tough start, and, and then Cheltenham on Tuesday. So, um, you never know. That it could be an interesting start to your career, Bristol Rovers. Yeah, definitely. You know, you you look at these, you know, you look at the fixture list, and you look at games like that, and it's you know, it's, it's exciting. Thank you very much. Cheers. Thank you.